Good afternoon. And now, the old man and the cellar. Last month, I heard an interesting story. A slice of Viennese life. And the story I heard was all about rats and potatoes. Once upon a time, a long time ago, Gerald, a very good friend of mine, used to work in the city of Vienna. And in those days, Gerald's job was a very hard job. A job full of stress. From seven in the morning until seven at night. A very full day. But Gerald knew how and where to escape to. The right place to go for a break. Gerald went deep underground. Gerald's office was in a very old building. And this old building went down deep below ground. In fact, this very old building had four very deep cellars. And it was down to the deepest cellar of all that Gerald would go every morning with his coffee and cake. And no one knew where he was. And no one could find him. And early one morning, Gerald got a surprise. He was not on his own. Sitting on a chair and peeling potatoes was the very old man who worked in the restaurant upstairs. And one of his jobs was peeling potatoes. The others were the washing up of the pots and the pans and general odd jobs. And even more surprisingly, the very old man too was not on his own. He was surrounded by hundreds of rats. And the rats were very happy rats. They were having a very fine meal. Potato peelings. Whilst peeling the potatoes, the old man was passing the peelings on to the rats. And after finishing his job, the old man got up from his chair and said goodbye to the rats. And the rats disappeared happily into the darkness. And the old man was happy as well. He had no potato peelings to carry upstairs. The rats had eaten them all. Man helps rats, and rats help man. And even now, and many years later, Gerald often thinks of that very old man and the rats in that long-ago cellar deep below ground. And every time Gerald sees a rat in his garden, he smiles. Gerald's fresh potatoes, too, taste very, very good. When looking back on our lives, it's people we think of the most. But animals too can play a big role, and rats were important for Gerald. They crossed his path in a cellar deep underground. The Old Man and the Cellar, a true story from life. <laughs>